Lisa, you're too much of a chicken to do it. I'm not a chicken. Well, then why won't you jump on the trampoline like I told you to? Because I don't like listening to you. But it's a dare. A double dog dare you to jump on the trampoline while mommy's not looking. <sighs> why do you always cause so much trouble? You're going to get me in trouble now, too. Oh, come on. Don't be a wimp. Just do it. All right. Only because you call me a wimp and I'm not a wimp. Yeah, okay, prove it. Go ahead, go. All right, I will. Woohoo! Woohoo! Yeah! Whoa, look how high I can jump. Look how high I can jump. Yeah, go, Elisa. Go, Elisa. Jump, jump. Go, Elisa. I totally dared her to do this. <laughs> Go, Lisa. Go. Look how high I can go. Look how high I can jump. I love my trampoline. I love jumping on my trampoline. Oh, oh no, she fell. Oh, mommy, mommy. Oh, mommy. Oh, Elisa, are you okay? What's wrong? What happened? What happened? Come here. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I fell. I fell. I think I hurt my arm real bad. Oh, let's bring you to the hospital right away. Let's go. Let's go, Elisa. Oh, sweet girl. I told you no jumping on the trampoline when I wasn't around. I know, Mommy. I'm so sorry, but I can't talk about it right now. It hurts. I know. I know. I know. We're going. We're going to the car. Oh, hello. I am so sorry to keep you waiting this long, Miss, um, is it Palchik? Miss Palchik. Yes, yes, that's it. Oh, okay. Um, so do tell me, what is the problem here? Well, my arm hurts a whole lot. It hurts so much, and I need you to fix it, please, doctor. Yes, yes. My name is M Dr. Melissa. Or you can tell, call me Dr. Harper as well. Either one is fine. Okay, Dr. Harper. I like that name. <laughs> and mommy, can you tell me exactly what happened? Well, I told her to not use the trampoline when I wasn't around because it wasn't very safe. Oh, indeed. Trampolines can be very unsafe when there's no one around to watch you, dear. Yes, yes. That's exactly what I told her. Anyway, she was jumping really, really high. Right, Elisa? Yeah, really high. It was awesome until... And then I fell off. I fell off the trampoline and I landed right on my arm and... Oh, it hurt so much. Okay, okay. We will get you taken care of, but the first thing we need to do is get an x-ray taken of your arm. We're going to put you in a wheelchair and then we will go to the x-ray room. Oh, can I come? Can I come? I want to go with Alicia. No, Alicia, sweetheart, you're going to need to stay here, please, or you can go out to the waiting room with your daddy. Aww, that's a bummer. X-ray seems so cool. You get to see inside of people's bodies. I wanted to see inside of Alicia's body. Uh, anyway, fine, Mom. I'll listen to you because I'm a good girl. Better than your other child who didn't listen and got hurt on the trampoline. Hey, stop that. That's not even funny, Alicia. <laughs> yeah. So, Mom, can I go to the gift shop and look around? Yes, dear. That sounds like a wonderful idea. Please, be a good girl and look for something for your sister. She is in a lot of pain. And I'm sure that something nice would make her feel better. Oh, yes, Mommy, of course. I love her. I just like to tease her, too, because it's fun. <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay, go into the gift shop. Whoop. Just in case you didn't know, my name is Alisa. And my name is Alicia. And we're twins. We're like the, the coolest, coolest twins, twins ever. ever. I mean, really. Except Elisa here doesn't like to listen to mommy all the time. And I always do because I'm a perfect child. <laughs> yeah, okay. I know that's not true. Everyone knows that's not true. But whatever. <laughs> you know what? I was going to get you something really cool at the gift shop. Maybe I won't. <laughs> that's not nice. I'm hurt. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'll get you something because I love you. Whoa. Look at this gift shop. I gotta get something really good for Elisa. 
Hmm, she's a pain in the butt. But I guess her arm really hurts. So that's what she says. Hmm. So, oh, a shake. I think she'd like that. I mean, I'd like that, and I'm her twin. Get that pink shake down. Hmm. What else? Oh, look at this doggy card. That's silly. <laughs> silly doggies. Um, not that though. Uh, oh, pretty flowers. I'm gonna get her these pink flowers. She loves pink. It's her favorite color. Do you think she'll love them? I think so. Hmm. Oh, candy. Do you think I should get those? I should totally get those for her. I'm sure she'd love them. But then again, it's candy. And I've been waiting in the waiting room for so long today. I deserve that candy. She gets the flowers. I'm getting the candy for myself. Mm, can't wait to eat them. Chocolate. Candy. You did such a great job getting your x-ray taken. I am so proud of you. Yes, me too, sweetie. Okay now, so we have the x-ray back and we're gonna put it in our machine here and take a look. See what's going on with that arm. Alrighty, mm, here's the screen. Okay, well it looks like... <gasps> it looks like they gave me the wrong x-ray. This is a foot. This is very clearly a foot. This is not your arm. I am so, so very sorry. Let me call my colleague and see if she has it. Just a second, please. Dr. Teagan, Dr. Teagan, could you come here for a moment? I need your assistance. Dr. Teagan, yes, yes, coming, coming. What is it that I can help you out with? Uh, Dr. Teagan, this little girl had just gotten an x-ray done for her arm, uh, and I unfortunately got a x-ray of a foot. Do you happen to have my arm one? Oh, yes, I do, and I actually looked at it for you. It looks like she's got a big fracture going right down her arm. Oh, my dear, okay. Well, now we know what's wrong and we can treat it. You are going to need a cast for approximately eight weeks for your arm to heal. Oh, eight weeks, that's a long time. Hmm. Okay, no, oh, you're gonna love it. You can pick the color you want in everything. Oh, cool. Well, I love pink, so I definitely want pink. Well, pink is an option. All right. Thank you very much, Dr. Teagan. We are all set now. Oh, you're very welcome. And I hope you feel better soon, sweetie. Oh, thank you, Dr. Teagan. You're welcome. All right. Let's get to putting that cast on. What do you say? Um, does it hurt? No, it won't hurt. Your arm will be a little sore, so it'll hurt like it does now, but nothing more. Okay, okay. Um, I hope my sister's back soon. I really want her here for my cast. Can we just wait a minute? We can wait a few minutes to see if she comes back soon. Absolutely. I will leave you two to yourselves, and I will be back in a few. Okay, thank you, doctor. Thank you. What I got you. Look what I got you, Elisa. <gasps> are those flowers? Those are beautiful. They are. They're for you. There you go. They're so pretty, aren't they? Oh, they are. I got those from the gift shop to make you feel better. Do they make you feel better? Does your arm feel better now? No, it doesn't, Alicia. Oh, well, hmm. maybe it'll work soon. So, did I miss anything cool? Well, I just have to get a cast put on my arm. <gasps> Ooh, a cast. That sounds kind of cool. Mm, yeah, they're going to make it pink for me. So, that's neat. Oh, yeah, that's really neat. I love it. Hmm, she said it won't hurt too much. Oh, okay. Um, I'm definitely going to watch, and I want to be the first one to sign it. I'm going to draw something really silly on it. Oh, hmm. Okay, I guess. Nothing I don't like, though. No, nothing you don't like. Promise. Oh, girls, girls, girls. You too. Have you learned anything at all, though, today, Alicia? Yeah, I learned that I'm going to listen to you more, Mommy, because this is a really bad boo-boo, and I never want it to happen again. I do get a cool cast, but I'd rather not have to do this. Yes, exactly. Please listen to me next time. It's only for your best interest, sweetie. I love you and your sister very much. 
Oh, we love you, Mommy. Love you, Mommy. Oh, Mommy went potty. Let's talk. Hey, Lisa. Yeah, Alicia? Um, hmm, I don't know. <laughs> really? That's all you have to say? Yep. I don't know. Hey, Lisa, guess what? I don't know what. Chicken butt. <laughs> <sighs> and you think you're the better child, really? Well, at least I listen to mommy and don't go on the trampoline when she's not watching. You do. Okay, it was one time it was a mistake, and it was because you dared me to. I mean, I dared you to, but you didn't have to do it. Come on. I know, you're right. I didn't have to do it just because I was dared, but don't dare me to do silly stuff like that again. I won't. But... Anyways, I wanted to tell you something really cool. Hmm, yeah, what's that? Um, I saw a baby. A baby? Yeah, there was a baby out in the hall. It was yelling and screaming. I think it was just born. <gasps> oh, I love babies. Ugh, no. It was weird looking. It looked like maybe an alien or something. I don't know. <sighs> we may be twins, but we are just so different. Yeah. Oh, hello, ladies. My assistant is going to be coming in in a few minutes here and giving little Miss Elisa a cast. A pink one. On the arm. Oh, yay. Okay. And you said it won't hurt, right? Not at all. And my arm won't be broken forever either, right? Like, this is going to make it better? Oh, yes, dear. The cast will not hurt. And don't worry, your arm won't stay broken forever. Like I said, it'll be about eight weeks. From there, we'll check it, but it should be good after that. Brand new. Oh, okay. All right. Well, Dr. Tegan will be right in to put that cast on for you. And young lady, be more careful next time. I don't want to see you back here. Oh, I don't want to be back here either. Trust me, doctor. Okay, good, good. We'll have a very nice weekend, ladies. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you so much, doctor. Okay, okay, okay. Who's ready for their cool pink cast? Uh, me, I think. Okay, dear. Um, and I'm sorry, What? what's your name, sweetie? I'm Alicia. And I am Alisa's twin. Oh, yes, I can tell that you two are twins. Right, I'm the cuter one, but yep, twins. <laughs> okay, well, sweetie, what I need you to do is go sit in the yellow chair over there because I am going to need more space to put the cast on your sister. Okay, I'll hop down. Okay, we've got our molds down here. Let me get this blue one out here for your little tiny arm. Okay, and there we go. Let me just wash my hands now and get the casting material. All right, here it is. Look at this. Whoa, that's cool looking. We're just gonna put this on your arm and then we're gonna put the mold over it and then you'll have a cast that fits your arm perfectly. So let's do this. All right, close the door. Yay, 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 yay. I should tell you, this is my favorite part of my job. I love doing casts. Well, okay then. That makes more sense now why you're acting so cuckoo. <laughs> yes, it does. Let's put that cast on. Wow, look at this. It's a nice pink cast, isn't it? Yeah, I love it. Mm, I mean, I feel like I could have done better and I'm like five, but. Oh, yes, it's so nice. <laughs> Didn't I do a great job? <laughs> okay, well, I am. Um, is there anything else that you need? Uh, no, I think we're good. Uh, make an appointment on the way out. Yes, eight weeks. We would like to see you back to make sure everything's healing properly and maybe readjust. Okay, okay. Thank you very much, doctor. Oh, thank you. I love casts. Okay, some of the people at this hospital are a little kooky. Can we get out of here now? Yes, yes. It's time to leave now. All right, girls. Let me help you down from the table there, Miss Elisa. And we will go on our way. Okay, you little rascals, let's not ever have a day like that again, please. No, Mommy, I would never do that to you. <sighs> would you stop? 
Oh, you're always so annoying. You're annoying. No, you're annoying. Oh, stop, stop. Girls, 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 girls. You both make mistakes. Everybody makes mistakes. You will listen next time. I'm sure of that, Alicia. Yes, I will. Of course, mommy, because I love you and I'm so sorry. And she dared me to do it. <gasps> what? Alicia, is this true what she says? Uh, maybe. So I've been scolding her this whole time and it's been because of you. But mommy, she didn't have to do the dare. This is very true. However, when we get home, the both of you are grounded. Grounded? What's that? That means you will not go out with friends and you will not use the phone for an entire week. <gasps> you can do that to a kid? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. It's because you don't listen and you do things that I tell you continually not to do. I'm sorry, girls. Hmm. Okay, Mommy, but we're totally going to do some real fun activities in our room. Okay, okay, so be it. Come on, girls, let's go. Okay. Okay. <laughs>